plastic pollution, a major challenge for many African countries. But Rwanda, a tiny Central African nation, is leading by example. The government officially banned the manufacture and use of plastic bags in 2008. It's the first African country to ever make such a move. And it has worked. Today, the country's capital, Kigali, is considered the cleanest city in Africa. Because at the end of the day, we are targeting clean Rwanda, what is Rwanda, green Rwanda, and where our people, they have a place, they have a city. They have a role to play in what we do. Traders had to find alternatives, and recyclable paper bags became an option. But it was not just about keeping Rwanda and Kigali clean. Agricultural production, for example, has seen a steady rise as farmlands were cleared of plastics. Drainage systems are no longer clogged. It's a huge success for the government. Officials here say it takes proper implementation of laws to succeed in such a move and that the government will not stop in its efforts to protect and conserve the environment. But they still face huge challenges. We are bothered by other countries which still use plastic bags. We have opened our market, East African community, we were trading with Congo, trading with Burundi, trading with our neighbors. Still, products are packaged in plastics. The call here is to other African countries to follow Rwanda's example. Officials say if it can be done here, then it can also be done anywhere else. Kofamrenje, CCTV, Kigali, Rwanda.